Hey, how's it going? Your favorite crap YouTuber dude here. j 4 t Foy. Playing some more of this here. Batman, the enemy within. We're going to get on with episode 4. And we'll see how it goes. Hopefully it's not too long. Like, not longer than like an hour and a half or some shit. And then I can get on, get on with my evening, and I really just want to get this over with because I go back to work tomorrow. I'm not quite ready. Would have liked to get this over with earlier in the day, but... It's a good day to sleep in, right? It's like fucking almost 5 o'clock right now. Yeah. So, hopefully y'all happen to enjoy this video. Enough to like and subscribe, drop some comments, share. Any and all additional support, very much helpful, much appreciated. Every little bit helps out a lot. Let's go. What episode are we getting into now? I can't remember which episode. Maybe episode four. What ails you? A shocking revelation forces Bruce into a desperate change of plans as the villain's lethal plot escalates. Let's go. What are we going to get into? Oh, we left it on a cliffhanger last episode. And obviously, Bruce Wayne, Batman, is not dead. So, we'll see how it goes. Anytime now. Yeah, I already know Dap's choices, tailored how, how I play it. I suck. So, probably the game and story sucks because I suck. War always carries a cost. And my war on crime is no different. The truth is, no matter how hard I fight, sometimes I have to lose. In order to save Selena from this fate, I had to give myself up. My life for hers. Now, there's nothing to stop Harley Quinn and her crew from killing everyone at the Sanctus facility and stealing a virus that could wipe out Gotham. Meanwhile, I face the cold embrace. <laughs> so what are you going to do to get out of this? Nope, you're just going to give up and die. Good job. <laughs> And? Come on now. Damn it. Okay, there's something we can do to get out of here, right? Just think. Oh, those aren't helpful. That's not helpful. The pack's not returning here for a while. I can't unlock it from here. At least it's going slow enough. <laughs> the EMP. It'll fry the auto locks on this chamber. Can you do it from here? I need to prime it before I can activate it. Oh, well, hurry up. What are we going to do? Okay, we got it. It's not still going, is it? Okay. Bruce, can you hear me? I'm here, I'm here. Harley had me thrown into one of Freeze's cryo chambers. But I'm okay now. Oh, well, that's a relief. I'm afraid I was starting to panic. I've got it under control, Alfred. Is the pact still in the subway? No. I'm bringing the car around. Call Waller. Tell her the pact means to slaughter their way into Sanctus, and I'm going after her. What? They'll have you shot on sight, Bruce. I'm not going as Bruce. It's time to let Batman handle things. Messily, too, probably. We'll see how it goes. 
Well, we obviously lived through that. Bodhi Spa. We're going to go over here, get ourselves a butt massage. And solve crime while we're at it. Oh, looks like somebody already beat us here. Alfred, I'm in. Any sign of Harley or the others? Nope, I see signs of a, quite a party, though. Somebody got a little too carried away. What were you? Whoa! Now that's a bit much. <clears throat> I wasn't expecting that. Got one of the spa workers. More death and destruction. What this were you expecting? Like what did they drag? Some bodies? Maybe. I don't. I'm disappointed. I don't see more bodies in here. Project Lotus. Probably this th this way, huh? Looks like the alarm system has been disabled. Who? Who's there? Me. <laughs> and? Batman! Get out of here or I'll shoot, I swear to God! No, you won't. Where did they go? They went down in the elevator. Do you have access? It's got to scan my eyes. <sighs> Another use for Riddler's eyes. Call it for me. No way. Those freaks are down there. What are you doing? Open your eyes or I'll do it for you. You son of a bitch! <sighs> Send paramedics. I've already made the call. Okay, thanks for your help. I could ask him nicely, he probably would have put up a bit of a struggle or a fight or, you know, refuse me, so I probably still would have had to force him. Maybe. Bruce, I contacted Director Waller. She, um, wants to speak with you. Now. Put her through. Batman, where are you? Give me a status update. I'm at the Sanctus facility. I split with the Pact, and they beat me here. It's a bloodbath. I ordered you not to blow your cover. What the hell were you thinking? You could have been there to prevent this. I was thinking about stopping the pact, which is way more than you're doing right now. Don't make this a fight with me. Just look at the bodies and ask yourself if it was worth it. We'll be there to back you up soon. We're gonna put an end to this once and for all. Looks like Sanctus security barely slowed them down. That's why you have to keep them there until we arrive. That virus cannot be allowed to leave the facility. Don't mess this up again. You should blow the place up at this point. This door lock requires a key card. Is this the only way in and out of here? We could hack it. No? We can look around on some of these bodies and find the key card, right? Maybe a pack of bubblegum? No? I know you got one in your butt, buddy. Hopefully it was quick. No key cord here. You sure you just don't want to hack it? Like everything else? They probably used the phalanx key. You didn't have a second one? Okay. Oh, what? What is this? What are you doing? Someone's trapped under there. 
And they're dead? Yep. Maybe he has a key card. What's this? Scientist. Well, serves him right. Easy. You'll just injure yourself more. It's too late for that. Stop them. Here. Take my... That's what I was going to do. Nope. Yep, that's what you get. They're working on, like, biological weaponry and shit? Like, nah, that's... That's fine. I don't mind you dying. You ain't shit. Don't touch anything unless I say so. We don't know what half this stuff does. We can make it go boom. What are you doing? You saved my life by taking the rap for the laptop theft. I'm returning the favor. I'm on guard duty along with three gunmen who are all watching that door up ahead. If I hadn't stopped you, you'd be full of holes right now. We don't always see eye to eye, but I'd much prefer you in one piece. I'm just glad to see you alive. Same. After seeing them throw you in Frieza's meat locker, I wasn't sure if that was the end. I've seen a lot of death recently. Harley encouraged Freeze and Bane. They killed anyone they wanted. I should have done something more to stop them. But I didn't. Bane! What did I say about touching the equipment? <laughs> Be quiet, you imbecile! I'm going to make this right. I'll help you stop them. Whatever nope. I have to do, they're not getting that virus. Whatever it is, I can do it. Good. We'll fight them together. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Anything in here could kill you. So keep your hands to yourself. We can help them. They should lose their hands. Just cut them off. Breach of Darkness. The first part of the episode 4 is done. Good. Alright, what are we going to do? Is there going to be like a fight scene and shit? No, what you're doing. Of course I know. Not distracted. He can execute this job perfectly. You should be keeping an eye out. Shut it, you two. Tick tock, Freezy. Get the virus and let's go. It's an automated extraction process. You can't rush it. Oh, that's it? What happened to your bulletproof armor? I tried to move back under cover. Oh, really? We have to go through all this cutscene shit again? Of course I Don't you worry about making a mistake. Do not distract him. He can execute this job perfectly. We have to go all the way to the back this far. Shut it, you Okay. Tick-tock, Freezy! Get the virus and let's go! It's an automated extraction process. You can't rush it. <sighs> I've seen Freezy's popsicle wife move faster than this thing. Okay. Here we go. That works. Oh, let's do this. Nice. Here we go. Let's do this. Batman. This is a 
distraction we do not need. You switching sides on us, kitty? I weighed my options, and what can I say? I don't like to lose. You made a big mistake. The virus is almost extracted. All right, Bets. What made you think you'd be able to stop all of us? I wouldn't put money on your chances of walking out of here. Maybe we should try a therapy circle. I know all your tricks, Harley. Please. I know your type. You think you know me. But you're so, so wrong. Unfortunately, we have a tight schedule. But I always have time to kill you. Get him, boys! But you don't... You're, you're not killing me. You're sending your goons to do that. Okay, we're going to do some quick time events. Here we go. You should have threw a couple more at him, like right at his head. Here we go. Nice. There we go. You need to sit the fuck down, buddy. Also, you should use like some of that anti stuff, whatever he's using. Whoa, I hit square though. And there we go. Oh, we should have done a shock, but I feel like he would have stopped it too. Oh, that's not good. Not gonna work. Come on. Fuck y'all. There you go, sit the fuck down. Alright, what else? There we go. Really, you're gonna let him do that to you? How about no? I hit I did hit the right buttons, no? And what? Oh. That's for messing with my Batman. Go fight your own hero. <laughs> Here you go. Sit the fuck down, buddy. Nice. Not just pummel his ass. There we go. Yep. And of course, he's eventually going to cut an end to that. How about no? Really, you're gonna let him do that? <clears throat> Let's do this. Nice. Yep, that wasn't pleasant. Either way, one of them probably would have got me, so that kind of didn't matter. Here we go. Nope, nope. Oh. Sweet. Come on. Hopefully by stabbing him and making him lose blood, it gets him out of his thing, rage, whatever the fuck that is, quick. There you go. Oh, it looks like he is out of it. I don't see the... his, his veins aren't... Oh, nice. You should try punching me with that arm now. Enough of this. You're done. Hopefully his arm shatters. Uh-oh, that's not good. Nora, I managed to save them for you. Please evacuate the lab through the emergency elevator. Oh, so there is another way out of here. We're in the facility now. Guess what, buddy? Harley! Wait up! No! I'm infected! What are you doing? You need me! Not anymore! Harley! Harley's getting away. Come on, we'll find you. Get down! Get 
stop Harley. You did enough. Now get out of here. See you around sometime. You keep an eye on Harley for me. Okay, now we get out of out of that. We get through the intro part. The enemy within. Oh, that was that was eventful. Hopefully, the rest of the episode is a little bit more action packed as well than usual, because the, the previous episodes were pretty heavily dialogue driven. Kind of boring. Sink the three search facility. All right, what now? Alfred, call Tiffany and tell her to get to the manor. Harley escaped with a virus. Right away. Get me a proper lockdown crew in here, Stat. I want bioscans on freeze. Do not let him out of that airlock. Move it, people! Good work here, Batman. Good work? Harley escaped with the Lotus virus. Your girlfriend, Catwoman, is nowhere to be found. Same goes for your boy, John. So if good work means half the pact is loose in Gotham, and we've got a megavirus in the hands of a psychopath, then yes, this is picture perfect. We still got another episode after this one. Colorful words to describe this situation. Catwoman and John are not a concern. Our focus needs to be on Quinn. As much as I hate to admit it, you have a point. Sanctus, right under our noses all this time. Chemical weapons, human experimentation. Sanctus was, is, the darkest part of the Agency's history. Oh, this place is just evil. And that's why we're shutting it down once and for all. We can take some of this equipment and put it to good use. This facility needs to be burned to the ground. I don't want so much as a trace of it left in my city. But that's not his call. I'm gonna need your help tracking down Quinn. She's out there with the virus, and that's a threat to Gotham we simply can't allow. Freeze must have an idea about where she'd go in these circumstances. <laughs> don't waste your time with that maniac. He'd say anything to throw us off track. But he's our best lead. Well, I disagree. Freeze is nothing more than a science experiment gone awry. You best keep your focus on Harley and the virus before anyone else gets hurt. That was strange. She just completely shut me down. She's normally so open to all possible leads. This is so unlike her. Waller was out of line. She should know better than to ignore your instincts. Usually, she does. Listen, Director Waller may think it's a waste of time, but I say leave no stone unturned. I'll see what I can find out. Hey, Will. Give me a hand with this, will you? I think there may be something we can salvage back here. Yep, I'm totally not up to, um, interrogating Mr. Freeze over here. We're not gonna open the door, are we? I guess so. Batman, have you come to gloat? <laughs> to revel in what you've done? Of course not. You don't deserve this. You need help, Freeze. <laughs> you think? I'm here to talk about Harley Quinn. I need your help to find her. If you want me to tell you what I know about Harley, I'm going to need something from you in exchange. 
that the agency intends to keep me prisoner with this virus living inside me. They mean to study me. Given the chance, I could beat this. Just like Riddler, he became stronger for it. You're saying Riddler became infected with the Lotus virus when he worked for Sanctus. If he could survive it, I believe I can too. That dial, there, they've keyed it into the temperature regulators in the airlock. All I need from you is to turn that dial. Let my body do the rest. Lower the temperature in the airlock. I know that I can fight this. Okay, my only worry... I will do that for you. But first, tell me what you know. I'm so glad you're agreeable. The truth is... The Lotus virus doesn't have to be this. Riddler's blood can turn the virus into something that can heal. That's why we stole his body. Why your friends in the agency had it on ice. My Nora will perish if I don't use Lotus to save her. Bane merely hoped to cure himself of his addiction. Harley already has the virus. Now, she needs a blood sample from Riddler's body. With it, she will have what she needs to create the serum. She'll go for the body first. That's how you will find her. I already have samples of the blood. Look for a temperature-controlled container. No. You have what you came for. Please, do as you promised. My only worry is he uses that opportunity to freeze and get himself out of there. Which hopefully he does not do. Now, hopefully, he doesn't take that opportunity to bust himself out. I need to get to the subway right away. If Harley's trying to make this serum, she'll go straight for Riddler's blood. I'm coming with you. The secondary properties of this virus, the serum they want to make from it. I've got a feeling Director Waller didn't want us to hear that. Which would explain why she steered you away from Freeze. What is she up to, I wonder? Waller always operates on some hidden agenda. Surprised you're only just realizing. I... I guess I'm not. Just realizing, that is. I guess I just have blinders on when it comes to people I look up to. Don't worry about that now. If we hurry, we can intercept Harley at the lair. We could use Bruce on this one. The less attention we draw to ourselves, the better. What does that mean? If Harley sees Batman coming, she may do something drastic. But if she sees Bruce, she'll think she can take you. Um, about the whole Bruce-Batman thing. I know it was you that told Waller. Are, are we... are we all good? I'd like to clear the air. Sure. We're good. Oh, <sighs> all right then. Episode 4. I forgot what it was called already. What ails you? There we go. That's what it's called. So we're a half hour in. Got two parts out of the way. Hopefully the remaining parts are like 15 minutes long as well. Let me see. That would be four parts. Another hour. Hour and a half long. I, 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 can, I can do that. I can deal with that. I suppose I should have seen this coming. She's become more and more erratic since she came to Gotham. I hardly know what she's going to do next. Harley? No. Director Waller. I'm not used to her keeping me out of the loop. Ah, damn! Ow! Ah, the 
hell is wrong with this thing? <sighs> Damn it, sorry. I, I, I've got a passive anti-surveillance system running. It must have triggered What did your... you say, Bruce? Looked like you were speaking, but can't hear so well without these. I was saying the car as a passive security system. It triggered feedback in, in your hearing aids. Crappy agency technology. Not your fault. Look, it's fine. I'd just rather not talk about it. Okay, I don't even remember what else she was talking about then. A part of me was sort of hoping we'd be taking the Batmobile. This is the Batmobile. Not that this car isn't great. Oh, we are taking it. I don't follow. I push a button, the armor plates flip, and voila. Batmobile. That's incredible. If you're not just pulling my leg. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Lucius Fox was a genius. You've put a lot of time and energy into this crusade. I prefer to think of it as a mission. Do you ever question it? Not the mission. I mean, the methods. The clandestine nature of what you do. The fear tactics. The occasional brutality. No judgment. I've done what I had to do. I don't always enjoy it, but it's part of being... Batman. If I don't question it, I'm as bad as the criminals I fight. That makes sense. I'm having a bit of an existential crisis. Existential crisis? <sighs> yeah, it's Waller. Why wouldn't she want us to know what Freeze told you? Things have gotten gray recently. Too gray. I don't know if I'm on the right side anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have brought this up. You should trust your instincts. They're what make you good at your job. I'm glad to hear you say that. It bothered me when she allowed the pack to obtain Riddler's body. Wait, that was intentional? I've had deep reservations about Waller. I can't believe I just said that out loud. She cannot know this. Any of it. Yeah, here's the problem with that. I think she already does. Hey, you sure you're okay to do this? Absolutely. You know, I looked through Gordon's case files about Harley. Her father suffered from mental illness that eventually drove him to suicide. An illness with a strong hereditary link. It's very possible she wants the serum to prevent the same thing happening to her. If she fails, she's got one deadly plan B. <laughs> Don't sound so worried, Batman. I'm here to help. We're almost there. We are? So we gonna get there and get on with this show? Come on now. Shut down their whole plan? No? Come on now. Old five points. Harley's back is against the wall. If she has Riddler's blood, she'll be incredibly dangerous. You don't need to tell me. She tried to freeze me to death. Then we're on the same page. Should just let me go in there first, and then we go from there. Do you think that means she already has the vials? I don't know, but it's worth a look. Maybe she got scared off before she could find them. Well, let's see. I say... Well, I can't even go over there. Maybe she is up in her little spacious, cozy hideout. What's this? C4? C4. Plastic explosive. Only a little, though. Must be remnants from something bigger. I don't remember Bane making bombs, and it doesn't match Freeze's M.O. Who then? Harley? John? Even money on both. Yeah, I agree. They're both suspicious. Damn it. What is it? They're gone. 
The vials are gone. C4 and stolen blood. How do those two things add up? So... Keep looking. There's got to be something more here. What more is here? What do we got here? What's going on? Blood, but... Was this here before? Do we got to touch it? What if it's infected blood? Dried. Must be from when Harley shot Bane's men. Perhaps. Let's go up here and see if anything is up here, maybe. What if his body's no longer in there? We can't open it. Why not? Huh. On the side here, someone's damaged this. But it's it you when you didn't let me open it before. Why not? I can hack it, right? Can I not hack it? All right, what, there was something over here to inspect. Oh, what is this? Is this what opens it? Hey, Abesta, does this look familiar? We call it a liminal device, a not quite as powerful phalanx key. Some agency field ops are issued one, and if they left it, they must have been rushed. An agency team has been here. It could have been used to access Freeze's container with the vials. It's possible. What else can we check out? Now can we open this, uh, the container? I wanna, I wanna guess that's what we use that for. Yep. It's not there anymore. Oh, God. I thought this thing was supposed to preserve him. Obviously, it failed. Wait. Decomposition is actually accelerated. They purposefully disabled the capsule. If that's the case, then they were trying to destroy the body. It's textbook asset denial. But it's some sloppy work. They were moving fast. Too fast. And if Harley decides to release the virus, that sample may be the most valuable weapon we have. Alfred, I did a bioscan of Riddler's corpse. I'm sending the data to you. The body is breaking down, so do your best with it. Received, Bruce. It's oh my. This may take a bit of time. So Waller takes the blood and has Riddler's body destroyed. That would make her the only player who could create a viable Project Lotus sample. Having all the pieces to the puzzle. Oh my god. Bruce. The Pact all had problems. Medical problems they needed solving. And if Waller's the solution, she can make them work for her. She's not above using leverage to get people under her thumb. I mean, look what she did with my identity. Harley. The virus. You could have checked out up here before. She could have been watching you, or whoever's up here been watching you. The whole time. But you didn't even let me check it out. Or want me to check it out. Oh, okay. Halfway through it already? Fortune reversed? Hey, I'll take it. Okay, what's going on in here? What? He's not dead. He's just knocked the fuck out, right? Well, he's clearly knocked the fuck out. <laughs> you came! Where is she, John? Where's Harley? I don't think we've been formally introduced. Doe. John Doe. <laughs> I asked you a question, John. I heard you, Bruce. I do understand English. Oh. She was here. 
Which she was here? Yeah. Ugh. Where is she now, John? This is important. You got some real nerve. You know that? Buddy! Remember the cafe? Just be yourself, John. Then <laughs> I stuck my neck out for you. Way out! Bane nearly ripped my head off. And for what? She flew the coop! And I have nothing. You steered me wrong. At every turn. Every bad piece of advice. Everything blew up in my face. This isn't my fault. Harley betrayed us. Both of us. Yeah. But you weren't in love with her. Point. It's over. The pact. The dream. Us. Not yet. It's not. She's still out there with a deadly virus in a city full of innocent people. Call me when you got something I care about. It always surprises me how heavy guns are. It's gonna be okay, John. I promise. I care, John. You know that. I'm nearly out of reasons to believe you anymore, Bruce. Well, it's been real. What are you doing, John? Leaving. There's nothing left for me here. A lot of bad memories. And a weird smell. John, I understand you want to run. I've run before. But problems, they just come with you, no matter how far you go. Nope. Pretty sure I can get away from that smell. Damn it, John. Listen to me. I need to find Harley. I don't want to do this anymore. Not for you. Not for her. John, please. This is important. I know it hasn't been easy for us, but I am your friend. Hey, buddy. Don't you remember the pinky swear best friends forever? The agency was here. They took the blood. I was up here in a very dark place. They didn't find me. But Harley did. I told her what happened to Riddler. <laughs> she gave me this. And where do you think Miss Quinn is now? We'd like to find her sooner rather than later. I want to find her. My heart can't take another kicking. I never want to see her again. She ruined me. I, I can't. You need closure, John. Face to face. Nothing else is going to make you feel better. I promise you that. I just can't say no to you, Bruce. <laughs> you gotta keep an eye on this guy. That Wayne charm gets him every time. You sure know how to spin things. All the right ways to uh, twist my arm. It's going to take me a few hours to find her. I have to check a few places, do some things. Okay, we'll come with you. <laughs> no. You won't. There will be plenty of time for John and Bruce later. This is... I need to do this alone. I'll call you when I find something. Wait, hold on. I really like your help, John. It's okay. Go. Bruce, let's talk about this. He'll come through. He's done it before. It's funny. When you first walked through that door, I honestly thought you came here to check on me. Sure I did. And you just left me there to freeze to death. In the agency's cold storage. Be careful. Thanks. Alfred, how's the bioscan analysis going? Nearly complete. I should have it ready for you when you arrive. I'm on my way. 
Now can we have another one of those? Wow, four parts done. What had to be done? I'll take it. I was about to ask about that. Now I just need to do two more parts, and hey, hopefully it's like another 10, 20 minutes, and we're done with this episode. That would be nice. I'll take it. Wayne Manor, especially the previous episodes, long as fuck. Red Dirt Codex files have been updated. Cal, you there? Maybe. I'm back. I'm taking over at the computer. Well, he's down here, isn't he? Um... Please don't. Help. Help can you hear me? Alfred? Oh, uh, 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 what's, what's the matter? Uh, Thomas, uh, let's, let's chat. Uh, now's the time. No, Al, it's me. It's Bruce. Yes, what would Master Bruce think about what you've done? Well, uh, he, he, he and the, the, the Cobblepot boy are playmates. Please, please wake up. Bruce, I... Where, where, where am I? Easy, easy. You're in the cave. Take your time, think back, and tell me exactly what happened. Ah, oh, no, it was... It was nothing. I was... I was working and I felt... I felt dizzy for a moment. Uh, I'm, I must have been more exhausted than I realized. You didn't have a seizure, did you? Well, basically, that's all there is to it. That's how I felt when, when I had a seizure. Shaking, and now you're, you're passing out. We can't keep ignoring this. You need to be looked at before it gets worse. Uh, oh, Jed. Actually, no. Oh. Oh. Thank you. I started I'm trying to lose my hands, and then I blacked Just out. Similar to that. Just give me a moment, please. All disoriented and shit? It's all nonsense. What is? Freeze's magic cure-all. It doesn't work as intended. Take a look. All right, what are we going to see here? The fire scan of Riddler's body. I used the analysis you sent me to simulate its interaction with the virus. And the bat computer promptly found holes in Freeze's calculations. You don't say. Lotus. Megavirus. Only one known survivor. Riddler. Freeze thinks his blood is now a key to unlocking Lotus's true potential. It appears that Lotus can be synthesized into a restorative agent for the human body. A remarkable one. Well, Free's got that part right, but... But as soon as Lotus repairs any physical problems, it causes irreparable damage to the subject's brain chemistry. It drives you insane. It's what Riddler meant when he said, I wasn't always like this. All of these people, all of them trying to kill each other, for something that will make them as deranged as he was in the end. We all should know by now that miracles come with a cost. Lotus is nothing more than a poison. Harley's already insane, Alfred. I doubt she's worried about taking it up a notch. Yes, you're probably right. Although if she wants the serum to avoid what happened to her father, well, <laughs> it's certainly ironic. Run the simulation again. Then forward the readings to Special Agent Imana Vesta. Ah, I already ran it several times myself. I, I wanted to, to be thorough. A silly notion, I know. My problems are purely psychological. My real cure is a very long vacation. Somewhere far away from Gotham. A place where the sun actually comes to visit. Then let's get you to a nice beach, huh? Or wherever you want to go. Ooh, the possibilities. That'll take some thinking. Avesta. I read your report. The 
serum makes the whole thing beyond dangerous. Did you find out where Waller's keeping Riddler's blood? Yeah. She's got the area on lockdown, but I think I can get myself in. And then I'm taking these things off the table. Permanently. It's too risky. We can figure something- I won't let Waller turn the agency back into something like Sanctus, Bruce. It's not up for debate. Good luck. Let's get you somewhere more comfortable. Oh, Bruce. Uh, Tiffany's up there. She's probably wondering where I hurried off to. Might as well have brought her down here with you. Sorry, Albert. We can't risk you falling again. Very well. Oh, we, we mustn't keep Tiffany worrying any longer. She's done quite enough of that the past few days. Ready? If she's even still here. Oh, are still gonna help him up, though? I'm afraid that's all we do. Worry the ones closest to us. You don't got a bat wheelchair? How come? Uh, okay, yes, thank you. The doctor is on her way. How are you feeling? Well, better. A little more rest and some tea and I'll be as good as new. Make that a lot more rest, Alfred. You're hurt. The only thing hurt is my pride. Which, sadly, even the doctor won't be able to fix. You can put up a strong front, but I'm not leaving your side until the doctor arrives. Got it? Understood. Should get an uh, MRI. CT scan. Should I be? About? You don't need to sugarcoat it. I just need facts. It's definitely concerning. Yeah, I've told you already that it's fine. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's just... There's a lot more to worry about right now than me. So... Bruce. Um... After our little talk at your office, I had an idea. There's something I want to show you. So, I've been working on this in my spare time. I remember you said you could use the help, you know, when you're Batman. So she wants to be my sidekick. About a tactical suit, in case I'm ever needed in the field. Para Aramid synthetic lining. Photo adaptive suit coloring. Full spectrum, full surround heads up display. I should be able to get the mesh fabricated in no time. And? I don't want her in the field with me, though. You don't need to be at risk. I'm getting ahead of myself. The yeah. last thing you want is me out there on the rooftops with you. This wasn't all just about me. You've been going up against some heavy opposition, Bruce. More than usual. Alfred told me how Bane nearly killed you. So I designed you this. I don't use guns, so. Gun. Let me read you the specs. Batman doesn't use guns, Tiffany. You mean, at all? I guess I've never seen you use one. It may seem easy, but trust me, killing is never a solution. Sure it is. Oh, right. Still, criminals are always trying to kill Batman. Are you telling me you've never once considered a gun? Just to even the odds. Of course I think about it sometimes. It'd be the easiest thing in the world. But easy doesn't make it right. Bingo. Listen, I should have thought it through more. I just got so caught up in the design, I didn't... I have a lot left to learn. No, don't be so hard on yourself. <laughs> and, oh, bonus bros carnival outskirts of town. Better hurry. 
I have to go. We'll be waiting right here. Okay, so what's next? Is that the end of that part too? That'd be nice. I doubt it. Be cool though. Bonus Brothers Carnival. Eleven twenty eight PM. What are we gonna get into now? John? Looks like they made themselves at home pretty quickly. Oh, Mad Hatter isn't here too, is he? Okay, well... It's gonna blow up, right? Boom. Broken. You think? And then pops up and punches him in the face. No? Dr. Quinzel. This is Harley's. Anything else to check out? Oh, let's use it. Come on now. And... You suck that much. She used a sledgehammer. What else? Nothing else to check out in here? We can go now? Cool. Let's go. Well, they've made this place interesting. But now we're starting to get an introduction to John's crazy, right? <sighs> nah, that didn't scare you, did it? Well, this is interesting. I like how they always... If I remember it correct, when I played Arkham Origins, there was some sort of crazy Joker scene thing. You know? Please. You're not making this easy on me, you know? When we can say the proof. It, 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 it wasn't me. I, I, I mean, it, it was me, but it, it was self defense. I, I know it needs work. Bruce? I'm so glad you're here. Please, it just... It, it's, it's not what it looks like. I, I can't explain. Just try and reserve judgment. Take a deep breath, John. Just calm down. It was horrible. Just horrible. But you're, you're right. I, I should do my exercises. Get, get a hold of myself. Yep, deep breaths. What happened? Is Harley here? She left just as I got here. The agents, they came looking for her. They're not supposed to just start shooting, Bruce. They're supposed to say, hands up. I've seen it on the TV. They just attacked you. I tried to talk sense into them, but they wouldn't listen. They, they just wanted blood. 
Something took hold of me. Something dark and vicious and desperate for survival. I grabbed the nearest thing and started swinging. <laughs> you think this is funny? I'm sorry. I, I always laugh when I'm nervous. All right, so what's this switch do? Let's flip it. Uh oh. Wow. I completely redecorated, didn't I? <laughs> I wonder what Harley would think of the new color scheme. <laughs> <clears throat> You said you hit them with something. I think so. I, I just grabbed whatever came to hand. This woman has a gunshot wound. Huh. Really? In the back. Oh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's coming back to me now. She was going for her partner's gun, and I, I just, I just went on autopilot. I didn't stop until I was safe. I've just been sitting here in the dark until you came in. Okay, sounds sounds like you did what you had to do. Exactly! It was a real life or death moment. I just sort of closed my eyes and hoped for the best. I felt so much rage inside me, Bruce. It was terrifying. It was like... It was like I became... Someone else. Someone dangerous. Well, I hope you're okay now. You think you're back to your normal self? Normal? Yes. I feel much better. Thank you. You don't have to worry about a thing. It was a momentary episode. A, a flash in the pan. It won't be a problem. I, I promise. Well, let's hope not. You believe me, don't you? Not really. You have faith in your good old buddy John, right? Of course I believe you. Oh, Not really. God. Thank you, Bruce. Thank you. Thank you. I wasn't sure I could count on you. Not after I discovered you put a tracking device on me. Not after the raid. It's been hard knowing you haven't been straight with me, Bruce. What tracking device? What raid? Secrets. When we're supposed to have all this trust between us. Everyone keeps secrets, John. Kind of the gig. Oh, Bruce, there are secrets, and then there are secrets. Yours is definitely a secret. You forget? I know you. The real you. Always hiding behind some kind of mask. Playboy, businessman, criminal, bad. Dun dun dun. You can't fool a friend. Someone who really takes the time to look. So he knows I'm Batman? R. The Batman. That's ridiculous. I'm the furthest thing from Batman there is. You don't have to keep your mask on anymore, Bruce. Not with me. After you fell on your own sword to save Catsy, there was no more doubt. So what? You think you can use that against me? Huh? Blackmail me? I would never! We're two threads in the same stitch, remember? Oh, my head feels all messed up right now. I need a purpose. I know where Harley is. She took a truck out of the city, across the Gotham Bridge. Let me help you stop her. You and me, Batman. We can clean up this city together. Unless... Uh, unless the stitch is truly broken. In which case, uh, we should... I'm gonna just pick one of them at random. Ways. I'm sorry, John. I have to bring you in. You do that to me. Really? 
after all the things we've shared? We could have done great things together, Batman. But you had to go and ruin it! Harley warned me about you. And now she needs my help. She was right. I belong at her side. We're gonna lose him on while well, trying to catch up with him. Yep. Alfred, I lost John. Something tells me he'll be running right back to Harley. Anything I can do? Give me a surveillance feed at the Gotham Bridge. Harley's trying to get out of the city with the virus and a truck full of explosives. I'll need to suit up to stop her. Maybe want to get a mask, too, you know, in case that virus gets unleashed. No? Is the part going to be over with? There we go. F fifth part is done. Zero sum game. One more part to go, and then I'm done. I'm glad about that. Didn't really want it to be too long. This is, like, about to be the preferred length of episodes I prefer. Gotham Bridge. Preferably. Yes. I'm glad it's going by quick. This just in, a breaking story from the Gotham Bridge. A woman dressed as a clown is in a standoff with government agents and the GCPD. Reports say she's threatening to set off explosives unless her demands are met. More as it comes in. All right, what's up? This standoff looks like it's just begun. Harley looks cornered. That makes her more dangerous than ever. GCBD needs to get these people far away. Alright, right here. I see Harley's truck, Alfred. I could drop straight under the cab, take her out before she has a chance to detonate the C4. But there are a lot of civilians. No time to waste. And it's gonna blow up anyway. You land off to the side just in case, you know. Uh oh. And they, it, while she was getting out, they could have sniped her. It's the only way you're getting out of this alive. Waller's agents have orders. Shoot and kill. I got a virus in my pocket and C4 in the truck. This is a dead man switch. My finger comes off it, like if I'm shot or something, everything goes boom. You tell them I want the goddamn vials of Riddler's blood, or I'm gonna blow this frickin' bridge to hell, and everyone on it! What's it gonna be, Bats? Doesn't seem like we got a lot of time. If you're afraid of inheriting your father's illness, I can help you find a cure. But this serum you want, it does more harm than good. How the hell do you know about that? I looked into it. It does irreparable damage to your brain chemistry. Oh, no, no. You're lying to me right now. I know it. I still want the blood. I see you found Miss Quinn. My people will take it from here. Stand aside. And we can all go on our merry way. She wants Riddler's blood, Waller. Give it to her before anyone else gets hurt. You should know by now, capitulating to terrorists isn't exactly my style. All of you can shut your damn pie holes. I want Riddler's blood right freaking now, or everyone here goes boom. Your threats are well and good, but I don't have it. Don't try and play me, lady. Your people took it from the subway. We took it, but someone destroyed it against my will. Someone on my team. Shit. It's gone. Whatever serum you thought you could make, it's off the table. It ain't true. It can't be. It is true. Disarm the detonator and put your hands behind your head. The hell I will! This is my show and... Uh-oh. Well, either way, that didn't matter. And everything is going to go boom anyway. <laughs> what the hell are you doing here? I came for you, Harley. I need you. 
Like a joke needs a punchline. Like maggots need meat. What are you doing? They'll kill us. <laughs> oh, oh no, Harley. I'm going to kill them. Believe me, it's gonna be a blast. Freeze! Stay where you are! <laughs> Think about what you're doing, John. You could still surrender before anyone else gets hurt. Maybe I want people to get hurt. Maybe I want people to suffer like you made me suffer. You say you're all about justice. Justice is a joke! Just tell me what's just about my life. I lost half of it in an asylum to a sickness I couldn't control. And you're not trying to get help or control it now. But now, I'm in control. No, you're not. Oh, the rest of them are dead. Here we go. Ah, I don't care. Whatever. It's just a cop. They kill innocent civilians all the time. You could have prevented everything. Instead, you made me into this. No, I didn't. You made yourself. Beautiful, Mr. J. I always knew you'd do great things. And as, there's gonna be like one more cliffhanger. So glad I could share it with you. <laughs> Is that gonna be the cliffhanger? What happened to the vial? They still got it? Episode 4, What Ails You? Hey, I'll take that. An hour and 15 minutes. Hey, trophy punchline. I'm cool with that. You, 33% four players, sit John down the path of being a villain. John was despondent when you told him Harley betrayed both of you. Appreciate that you allowed him to leave to find Harley by himself. You have broken John's trust and he has sworn to become your mortal enemy. Okay, so I was actually in the few that made him a villain. 56.2% of players let te left Tiffany feeling reflective. Sell him after learning about Batman's code. Uh, reflective after your discussion about Batman's code. 77.2% of players left while they're feeling livid. Uh, was supportive when you showed focus on going after Harley. Irritated Waller when you said she shouldn't use the Sanctus tech. Uh, was livid when you suggested giving Harley what she wanted on the bridge. And 48.9% of players left a vest feeling gratified. Relieved that you didn't hold the fact that she told Waller your identity against her, understanding about your pragmatic approach to Batman's code, gratified by your concern when you cautioned her about destroying Riddler's blood. 76.7% per of players left Al Al Alfred feeling proud, reluctant when you addressed his illness, made him feel cheerful with the mention of a vacation, and proud when you advised Tiffany thoughtfully about Batman's code. What else? Lower temperature for Mr. Freeze, 93.8% of players did show compassion. And trust John to find Harley by himself, 87.5% of players trusted him. That's, that, really? That's, that's it? There was only two of those options? Things? Well, it seems like now... They have more than five options that does determine the outcome. Well, not options, but choices that determines the outcome of how the episode plays out. That's that's cool. That's interesting. Um, either way, uh, John Doe. Joker would have became a villain, so I mean that kind of sort of doesn't matter. 
he would have became a villain anyway. Um, there wouldn't have been anything I could do to stop him, probably. And either way, I say the episode would have played out as it did. Um, for the most part. And it seems like kind of sort of most of the options don't really matter too much anyway. Either way, you kind of get to the same finish point. Slightly different endings here and there. I do want to go back and play some of the older Telltale games, especially like play through Walking Dead games again. Um, yeah, that's really only other Telltale games I ca I'd care to play replay. Not anytime soon, though. Um... I liked it though, it was decent. It was alright. Another shitty Batman Telltale episode, pretty much. What can we looking for looking forward to? Look forward to in the next episode? I'm not sure, but now Now John, the Joker, will be full on Joker. And I imagine we'll have to deal with his bullshit, so not going to be any surprises as far as that goes there. I wouldn't be surprised if they do some pearl some surprises later on in episode 5 though. If I remember correct, the agency Waller she heads the suicide squad if I remember. Let's continue. Um, I don't follow DC, Batman, superhero universe stuff very closely, but if I remember correct from playing Arkham Origins, uh, that's the information that I picked up. If I remember Waller being the person that is in control of all that. Anyway, uh, I'm glad it was a really short episode. I prefer episodes to be about this length, hour, hour and a half. I'm cool with that. Uh, shorter than an hour feels a little too short. But again, I'm cool with it. As long as, like, they get through their main points that they want to get through in the episode, I'm cool with that, you know? Um. So, for right now, I'm done, caught up on the Batman the Enemy Within episodes. I will be playing the fifth episode whenever that does happen to be released. I think the most recent episode came out, just, this episode came out just a couple weeks ago, I think, like late January, so maybe like a week or two ago now, um, from the point of recording this, because it's like February 4th, so. My, my the, the pace I've been going, I probably won't get this up for like a week or two. Maybe sooner, we'll see how it goes, right? So anyway, I don't need to drag this out. Uh, I need to get, I need to start getting ready to go to work tomorrow, so... Go back to work tomorrow. Start my work week up. Today's a Sunday. I work Monday to Thursday. So, um, yeah. Hopefully, you happen to enjoy this video, recording session, commentary, gameplay, the game itself. Anything enough to like and subscribe, drop some comments, and share any and all additional support is always very much helpful. Every little bit helps out a lot, and is much, very much appreciated. And I want to thank you, my favorite viewers, supporters, subscribers, best friends, cuddle buddies, and butt buddies for joining me. Keep me company, stopping through and supporting me. And I look forward to seeing you around again here very soon in the next Batman Enemy Within Episode 5. Other Batman video and games on my channel. Other games and videos on my channel. Maybe elsewhere on YouTube or my, I'm, 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 I'm on my other channel too. So, look forward to seeing you around again here very, very soon. Cool. Have you a good one?